Alright guys, so this is basically the easiest strategy that I have found. We're on the uh, summoning pits on Destiny. It's the one with the giant ogre creature. And, um, there's me dancing. <laughs> but, uh, but basically, um, this is the easiest strategy I've been able to find. Now, it takes a little bit of patience um, for you guys that... There's going to have to be a fall guy. Basically, you see me. I'm sniping people here. Um, this room I'm in... This is a good room because they won't follow you all the way back. Um, but uh, it's also a dangerous room because you'll see this purple thing that's up in the sky right there. See the red blimp on my radar? Now when that purple thing pops up, you got to get back here and uh, just hide. I mean, basically, my job is to just stay alive, you know, so I can revive the other players. Um, that's basically my whole job, so... Having some uh, technical difficulty, my game freezing up on me a little bit. Um, so here I am sniping this ogre thing. <laughs> but uh, but yeah, I mean, um, this is just—it's a stupid easy strategy. If you guys are having trouble with this board, this is the best way to do it. What I'm doing is two players are out in the room with the giant monster, and me—I'm just chilling back. Um, in this room and like I said my job is to just not die I can go out there and attack and do as much damage as I can um, but basically overall I'm just not supposed to die so um, you know that's that's basically what we're doing here I'm just gonna play through this I mean, I'll admit it, it gets kind of boring, guys. Like I said, I gotta just sit back here. Doo -doo -doo. I'm, I'm playing it on my DVR, so sometimes my laptop freezes up. And that, that's why you'll see me mess with the uh, computer here. Because it doesn't, it's high speed, it doesn't, the program I'm using doesn't quite keep up. <laughs> I'm just attacking the ogre. Just like I said, I'll pop out. Um, you'll notice the, the bad guys come in waves. So basically what I did is once I killed a wave, then I would go out there and shoot at the ogre, do as much damage as I could, and, you know, once I start to get worried about, yep, yeah, see, bad guys are starting to spawn. Once you see bad guys starting to spawn, like I get said again, if, if you're the fall guy, your job is to stay alive, so you, you just don't want to gamble too much. I'm starting to get shot. Uh, see? See, there is a, no, no, I'm not, not messing with it. Not messing with it. might be a little bit of lag to the video I'm not sure if everything's gonna line up with what I'm saying hopefully I'm gonna try to match everything up see how it works oh yeah see it just froze yeah, I'm on. Yeah, that almost got me killed Get the computer this is uh, pretty boring right here just sitting here there we go a little bit of action for me. Just chilling in this room back here. This witch. Fuck you, witch. Mm. <laughs> ah! Ah! I'm stuck. Oh! Oh, shit. I'm dead. I'm dead, guys. Stay alive. Do not die. I uh, failed. I failed. My job was to stay alive. I fucked that. <laughs> so, don't do that. Take the safe route. I promise you. The first time I tried to play this map, it took me about two hours to beat. Because we all three kept running out there like, 
ah! you know, radio attack, bombard, and we kept dying bad. So, like I said, this is, here we go, this is the easy strategy. This is the sure proof, you know, I, I think it, from this point on, I think from the point we got to the room, to the point it takes us to beat it, doing this way, uh, I think it takes about, this is like my third time playing it, I think it takes about 15 minutes to it this way. From the time you enter the room to the time you kill him. It should take around 15 minutes, so. You blasted fool. You don't know who I mean. His chest piece is his weak spot. You don't have him in the chest. It does the most damage. Jesus. Just, dang, I'm just chilling. some of the fatty stuff you know some of the more boring stuff because um, I was just basically just sitting here killing stuff the video was it, the original video is about 15 minutes long just let you guys know right around I'm guessing it'll be right around there because we're pretty close to the end you'll see me right here <coughs> we should be getting there yeah I mean he, he doesn't have much health left it's gonna take another two minutes three minutes probably Thinking, I think we killed everyone. I might be able to go out there and start shooting. Them. Oh, oh, there's a witch. See, I won't die. Your job is to stay alive if you're that guy. So, and sometimes you know, if you're unable to beat this level, you gotta take that responsibility on. You know, it's not the most glorious job. I just sit back respawn my teammates when I need to, but it's whatever. You gotta do what you gotta do. First time I played this map, I was like a level 10. I kept dying instantly. And this was the only way I could figure out how to beat it, so. Um, yeah, and you'll see right here at the end, we're getting ready to kill him. I'm guessing he's, he's pretty much about dead. And I hope the strategy helped you guys out. You know, this is the easiest way i found. Um, if you guys have an easier way, let me know. And as always, thank you for watching. I'm Z, and I'm out.
Finally, the abomination has been destroyed. The Vanguard will be grateful. What's up guys, Z Shit here. Now if you enjoyed the video, make sure to go ahead and hit that like and subscribe button. What? What that? That's it. That's all I got. Get, get the